to my channel, Cupcake Queen. Today, we're going to be doing wine cork pumpkins. The items you will need are twine, paintbrush, leaves, paint, tray, and cork. And the hot glue. You want to have 25 corks and one of them cut in half. See, I cut it in half. First thing you want to do is lay your corks in two rows of four and, and two rows of five and one row of six. The next thing you want to do is hot glue each of these rows together. And for my younger cookie fans, you might want to have your an adult help you. So I'm going to, to have my grandma do it for me. That, look, that for sure looks hot. So that's why we said we want you guys to have a grown-up helping you. We're almost done. Just have those rows over there to go. I'm excited to put it, to paint and put on the leaves. Almost done. Right? Right. Just, wait, is there, this is the last row, right? This is one row of four. We have to do one more row of four. Oh, yeah. Now you want to stack your corks on each other like this. Five onto four. Six onto five. Then you want to stack your five onto the six. Then your four on top and then your stem. Then it's going to look something like this after you hot glue it. I'm going to go ahead and have my grandma hot glue this together. So she's going to take it apart again. And, and when it's done, she's, and when she's ready to hot glue, she's going to put, and she's going to put them back in order. So Sophia, I have a tip for them. You want to put the hot glue towards the back of the pumpkin so that way when it's standing up, they won't see the hot glue. If you hot glue it too close to the front, you'll see the hot glue and you don't want to see that. It's still time. <gasps> cupcake, cupcake fans. Now it's time to paint. You just want to paint the tips of these. Oh, and by the way, Cupcake fans, this will take a few codes. 
So, what I mean by codes is you have to paint it a few times. Okay, so we had an unscheduled power outage, so now we're going to finish up our pumpkin project. I have a, today I have a smaller glue gun that I can actually handle, so the next thing you want to do is glue your leaves to the pumpkin but we you don't need that much of the glue all you need is a little bit and then you want to do the other side Next, you want to wind your entire twine around the pumpkin stem. And then when you have it round, just pull it tight. That's tight, all right. And there you have it, a fall decoration. Just make it your own and be creative. And don't forget, you could always paint the stem brown or green. I think I'm going to end up painting my stem green. Bye, Cupcake fans. Hope you enjoyed this video. And stay tuned for more fall crafts. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the like button. Bye!